Hello everyone and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox 2 video. Today we are doing another episode of checking out one of your guys' solar systems. But before we get into that guys, I want to say a massive, massive thanks as we are so close to 7,000 subscribers now. I mean, I'm literally looking at the number right now. We are literally less than 45 away. I mean, probably 48 hours time we'll probably have it. So yeah, just a massive, massive thank you to everyone who's recently subscribed, continues watching the videos every time and leaves likes and all that good stuff. Yeah, really, really massive thank you to you all for that. But yeah, now getting into today's video, we have one system to do, just one actually, because um, I only saw one in the upload for um, this person. So we have one system to do from Space Zombie or just a zombie. I don't know, because uh, he goes by two names. So yeah, I, I don't know if I have a link to him. Or not so yeah if you want to make yourself be known in the comments go ahead um but yeah i've got one system from him today so yeah we'll go and get straight into it so his system is called a system of life okay so let's search this up so like so so a system if i go to my sims so if i go a system so of there we go a life and other things here we go so let's see what he has got for us today so here we go all right a system filled of life even at the toughest points okay Right, so let's see what we got here. Okay, pretty simple looking system for a change. That makes a nice change actually, because it's not, or um, well, people always make pretty complex looking things. So it's nice to actually go back to something a little more simple. Right, so here is a gallon here. So this is our main star. So it's a little bigger than the sun in all of its stats there. Luminosity is bigger as well. Righty, oh, so right, first planet here. So yeah, I have no idea how to pronounce this one. So yeah, here it is. So let's see, 500 degrees, a pretty hot. Venus-like object with a bluish atmosphere. It's not very thick. Um, which you can obviously see to the surface there. So there is that one. Rightio. Right, next up we've got Eden over here. Or oh, no, Fidon actually. I thought it said I thought it was an E, but it's actually an F. So here it is here. Mercury-like object. Larger than Earth though. So pretty large um rocky object. Right, so that has a pretty crazy orbit. All right, next up we got this one here. Yuri Nas, there we go. So there we go, 500 degrees, so similar to the first um, object we saw around the star, actually. All right, next up we've got Lapis over here. Oh, it looks like Pluto, look at that. That reminds me of the um, regular Pluto in the game with the colour theme. Very nice. Lapis, right to you. I thought it would have been blue, honestly, because Lapis is a, obviously something you find on the ground. It's like a blue thing, isn't it? So it's, it's a blue rock. Uh, so Lapis. Next up we've got Cupic over here. So this is an um, ocean world. Pretty um, Earth-like in size and stuff as well. So there it is there. Let's go on composition. Let's have a look at it. The stats are 95 and 41 for it. Right there. Rightio. Not much land, though. I'm pretty sure if you gave it more land, the life could go up for it. Um, okay. So next up we've got... Oh, this one. This is in our solar system. He's made a big version of it, though. Yeah, this old little object has rings between um, Saturn and Uranus. I can never pronounce that thing, but... Yeah, there it is there. It's very similar stats to Earth as well. A little more land on it. 95 and 91, so we've got some pretty high stats on that as well. Right, yo, there we go. Pretty cool. Okay, now we have this one over here. So, Nuska, similar um, color and stuff as well. There's its stats as well, 87 and 26. So, it seems to like going with the grayish landscapes with the blue water by the looks of it. Because, yeah, all these look like default color options. So, there is that. Right, now we have Beric over here. This one looks like it's got a little more colour to it with the land. Yeah, there we go. Reminds me of my original Pascal in colour, actually. So, yeah, they've got another life the, uh, or lifelike good planet on here. This one's got some pretty high stats for it as well. So, there we are. How far away is this from the star as well? About, okay, 1.6 AU. Okay, so we're in the 1 AU area for this. But remember, the star is brighter than the sun. So, makes sense to be a little further away to have the Hatterball stuff. All right, next up, we've got this one over here. Fittinus, I know that's one of the names that you can get, very pretty common. So here it is here, so it's got more of a brownish grey colour to it, right there. And it's stats, 96 and 80, you've got some pretty high stat rockies in here. All Earth-like in size as well, so that definitely helps. And I'm guessing the surface pressure is around one Earth as well, because, yeah, if you have a surface pressure at about one Earth, that's always going to give you um, bonus points for the stats. Alright, so now we're going all the way out to this object over here, so it's just a little asteroid, so we don't really need to zoom in on that. Then we have Lorpa over here. Hey, is this a Neptune? Let's see here. Halo. Oh, yeah, that's looking... Oh, hang on. No. I almost thought for a second it was, but no, it's it's a Uranus. You can see the band on the there, that menacing band of the regular Uranus. Ah, that's um, that's um, that one there. 
That's a shame. I thought it was Neptune, but no, the band is the Uranus Green as well. I should have picked up on that. Um, but there, and, and the stats as well. 14 Earths. That's or oh, 14 Earths. Yes, um, what Uranus has. Um, then lastly, we have um, Salby at the end there. Ah, I thought it was a Neptune. Silly me. Um, so yeah, there it is there. And then there are its stats. All right. So there we go. There it is there. Okay. Right. So is that everything in here? Okay, because that was the only system they sent in. So, yeah, not the longest one of all time. But, yeah, here's a full lineup of all the objects here. So, let's um, go to those. Right. So, yeah, a lot of Earth-like objects. I guess um, when he says a system of life, it um, is pretty um, correct on that. I mean, look how many rocky objects there are with all of those um, Hatable stats and stuff like that. I mean, that is a, quite a lot, I have to say, for all of that. But, yeah, just looking up the chats right now, I'm just um, going through them. Yeah, that's the only system he sent in. So, um, yeah, that does it for today's video, guys. Sorry it's a little shorter than normal, but the person only sent in one um, system. So, I guess... Um, that's the way we play the game today, since um, there's only one to do. So, yeah, there is that. So, yeah, massive thank you for Just a Zombie or Space Zombie for sending in their system. Like I said, I don't have a link to your channel down below, so if you want to make yourself be known in the comments, then go ahead. I can put a link in when I'm around to do it. But, um, yeah, that is it, guys. So if you've got your own systems to send in, make sure to join my Discord server and you can send them in on there. Um, as well or you can do it in the comments but just please note if i don't get around to doing them just keep sending them on the new ones of these videos because it's really hard to keep up with all the comments that come through they, they do get lost very easily so i'd still recommend to join the discord as the main way of getting a system in but um yeah just um wanted to put that out there because i know some people do send them in and then i literally just lose them i can never find them so yeah just please um keep that in mind if you want to send them in the comments but um yeah that's everything guys let's even go for 40 likes on today's video and yeah that's about everything so make sure to subscribe if you're new helps on the journey to 7,000 as we are so 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 close now and also a massive thank you for watching as well and yeah i'll see you in the next video goodbye